What's going on YouTube? Derek here with a new series for you all. This is going to be the first entry in a series called You Don't Know Jack. In this series, we will talk about all the movies and TV shows that have a protagonist named Jack, such as the 24 series with its lead character Jack Bauer, played by Keeper Sutherland, and the Jack Ryan franchise, and the Jack Reacher franchise, and... Well, that's all I can think of right at this moment. So sit back, and relax, and get ready for episode 1 of You Don't Know Jack. So in the news today, multiple reports are coming out that Amazon Prime Video has won the rights to develop a television series based on Jack Reacher, the hero from Lee Child's hit crime thriller novels. It's also being reported that Nick Santora who created the CBS action drama series Scorpion has been tapped as the showrunner. He'll also write and executive produce the series. Lee Child, Don Granger, and Christopher McQuarrie will also serve as executive producers. Alongside Skydance's David Ellison, Dana Goldberg, Marcy Ross, and Amazon's Carolyn Harris. Since 1997, there have been 23 novels published, which have sold over 100 million copies to date, and two feature-length film adaptations, Jack Reacher and Jack Reacher Never Go Back, starring three-time Academy Award nominee and three-time Golden Globe winner Tom Cruise of Mission Impossible fame. This is the second collaboration between Amazon Prime Video, Paramount Television, and Skydance Television joining Tom Clancy's Jack Ryan, which stars John Krasinski in the title role and was recently renewed for a third season ahead of its second season premiere later this summer. Now, you may be asking yourself, will Tom Cruise be involved? The short answer is no. Cruise will not be involved with the series, as far as I know. And he certainly won't be playing Retreat. The character's creator, has decided that the 5 foot 7 inch Cruise is just too small to play the 6 foot 5 inch creature. Cruise, for all his talent, didn't have that physicality, the child told BBC Radio Manchester in an interview in November of last year. I really enjoyed working with Cruise. He's a really, really nice guy. We had a lot of fun, child said. But ultimately, the readers are right. The size of Reacher is really, really important and it's a big component of who he is the novels, you want to say. Cruise's two films in the franchise, 2012's Jack Reacher and 2017's Jack Reacher Never Go Back, performed reasonably well at the box office, but met with mixed reviews from critics. For those of you who may be unfamiliar with Jack Reacher, he is a former major in the United States Military Police Corps with the United States Army. He was born on a military base in Berlin, October 29, 1960. He has no middle name, and most people simply call him Reacher. Even his own mother called him Reacher as a child. As said earlier, Reacher is 6 foot 5 inches tall, weighing in at 250 pounds. He lives a vagrant lifestyle, never staying in one place for long. He states that he has a genetic disposition towards roaming about citing the British Empire, the Vikings, and the Polynesians as groups with similar wanderlust, while he accepts that there is an economical necessity behind the voyages, he maintains that some of them could not stop. He's good with numbers and is also described as a skilled marksman, principally in the novel One Shot, being the only non-marine to win the U.S. Marine Corps 1,000 yard invitational rocket competition. As you can probably tell, Reacher is a bit of a badass. So, while I was initially disappointed that there would be no further Jack Reacher films, the news today has made me very happy. So, those of you who are familiar with the franchise, who do you want to see step into the role of Jack Reacher? Were you pleased with Tom Cruise's performance? Were you among those that thought he was completely wrong in the role? Let's talk about that in the comment section down below. Also, if you like the content that I'm putting out, please don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. As always, I've been Derek, 
and you've been you, and I'll see you guys and gals in the next one.